easy to understand why across Iowa tonight, Iowans are meeting in libraries, schools and community centers. It's kind of weird because most of those places have been closed since Friday mm -hmm. because of weather today in observance of MLK Day. WHO 13's Roger Riley was in Greene County all today showing us how small town Iowa gets ready for a very busy and very cold caucus night. Well, here in northern Greene County, the Republicans will be meeting here in this room. It's part of the Chardan Public Library. Chardan is a small town in the northwest corner of the county with just under 400 people. In Chardan this day with the wind, it feels like 100 below zero. The wind is howling and the snow is piled up in some places. You can still find warmth inside the Chardan Library. Here is the community meeting room where the Northern Greene County GOP caucus takes place. But first today, a meeting of the St. Patrick's Cemetery Board. But it's not known how many will venture out on this night to caucus. I, I really don't know. Um, four years ago, we had the Democratic caucus in here and we were full. We used both rooms. Not as full as we had been in the past, but we probably had 45, 50. I'm, I'm get, with the weather, who knows how many will be here this year. We're really proud of our school, Peyton Chardin. Um, still a K through 12 um, building. Earlier I said it feels like 50 below here. Actually the temperature's zero, but with that wind whipping it really feels really, really cold. But if you go out tonight, make sure you put all your layers on to get to the caucus. From Jordan, Roger Riley, WHO 13 News. Uh, you can't see it. Roger's smiling in that video. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. We could hear it in his voice. Uh, <laughs> it's getting real though. Uh, Urbandale just canceling school for tomorrow. I don't think they're going to be alone. It's just too cold for those buses to get going. Yeah. The diesel gels up. It's just not safe. Well, kids